Hello and welcome back. My name is Nicole. If you're new to my channel, I love everything decor. I'm not one style, I'm all styles. If I like it, I'm gonna decorate with it. This home we're currently working on is a home that we purchased back around the latter part of February and we're slowly redoing it. So I had one more bedroom that I needed to fix. And today I wanted to share with you all the bed that I bought off of Facebook Marketplace absolutely gorgeous solid wood it's oak so it does have the color that i don't particularly care for is orange so um i'm going to change it and i want to show y'all the process that i went through to change it now i'm not completely finished with the bed but i wanted to show y'all the footboard and the process of what i did to get it the way i the look that I wanted. So let's get started today. Oh, and some updates. So this week we have plumbing going into the cottage. We have tile work, I'm thinking on Friday. So a lot of things happening out at the cottage for my parents. Then, oh, and we have um, air conditioning coming in. Our air went out in our bedroom. <laughs> so we kind of did a twofer. We did mother and daddy's uh, cottage and we're having to redo ours on this side of the house. So our bedroom has been a little warm and we've been living and praying through that. But um, all is well, Thursday we're gonna get a new unit put in our home and then the split unit put in my mom and dad's home. So I was excited today. I got to FaceTime with the plumbers and talk about certain things. And we've got cabinetry in this past weekend. We got some walls put up. So I'm excited to share that with you all again. But right now, let me show you what I did to this bed. So this is the bed. This was the picture on Facebook Marketplace. Added to the house, just kept looking at it and thinking about it. And as much as I loved it and I wanted to leave it the same, I just couldn't. So I've been kind of scrolling through Pinterest and looking and trying to decide what to do. Look at those rails. So I think, I think I'm going to do oven cleaner. Wear a hat, sometimes play chess And when I'm out I'm looking for that vintage flame But all complexions that I do This oven cleaner is scaring me But I really think this is going to be pretty I've already done the bed rails I haven't sanded them yet But they're beautiful Let's go outside and look at the footboard the footboard is absolutely gorgeous. Look at these rounded edges on either side. That's only on the footboard, but I've already got my oven cleaner on there pretty heavily. And um, you can already tell it's starting to kind of bubble. I love this footboard. With all the detail of it, you can see it's already taking the um, finish off. So it's really, really pretty. I'm super excited about doing this bed. And I've only used one can. I, I'm still on my first can of oven cleaner. But once I get this sprayed off, I'll let y'all see it soaking wet. I think it's going to be beautiful. I'm super scared to put the hose to it. But I think it'll be pretty. So I'll let you look at it when I get through Here it is. It has kind of a zigzag line through the center, but I think once it dries, it'll look totally different. But oh my gracious, to put that water hose, it scared me to death. So here is the footboard. And you can see on this side right here, I did do a little white wax and I'm gonna kind of sporadically kind of go over it in certain areas just to give a shadowy look. I've sanded it. I did have to sand it a bit because it still had some of the um, finish on it. So I did sand it after I finished my um, washing it off and then letting it dry in the sun. So I did all of that, but this thing is absolutely gorgeous. I am loving 
how this turned out. I really didn't think I wanted to do any wax on it and I'm not going to cover it in wax. I'm just going to put it here and there, just kind of a hint of white here and possibly over here and just, you know, just sporadic, okay? So I will show y'all that once I get through with the waxing. So here it is, you know, I had this white here. I put a little bit down there, all the way across, some over in the corner, on the top area. So it's just shadowing it. That's all I want it. I want it to look like it's weathered in the barn <laughs> and I love it like this. And I tried to put a sealer on it. So for me, I could not put a, like a clear coat on it because it makes it darker and I don't want that. But let me show you the headboard without anything on it. So it's just the headboard with no white wax. Look at it. I really do like it just raw, but I think I'm gonna have to add some finishing touches. But I'll keep y'all up to date. Thank y'all for joining me today.